another video. And I know I told you guys in my penny video yesterday that I would not be going out penny shopping. But I decided to go on and stop in a store near me on my way to work. Because this one store does open up an hour earlier than most of the stores. So I did go on and decide to go in and check out their store while I was over that way on my way to work. So I did find, let me see, what is this, five books here um that did penny out today now i told you guys that there were going to be some one dollar two dollar and three dollar books that pennied out today and they're all going to have different upcs now all of the one dollar books have the same upc code on them all of the two dollar books have the same upc code and all of the three dollar books have the same upc code on them so you may find some with these same exact titles here that i found i've got a frozen book here a Sleepy Time with Aurora, Sophia the First Book, we've got a Doc McStuffins and a My Turtle and Me book over here. Now, you may run across these same exact titles, but what you're going to need to do is flip over onto the back and check the UPC. Now, you're going to be looking for these last four numbers right here. And if you find any books with this 1718 on it, that were originally a dollar, that is going to be the book that you're looking for and that book will ring up for a penny when you go to the register now um i didn't find any of the two dollar books or any of the three dollar books in the store that i went in this morning don't know if i'll stop by any more on my way home this afternoon but i just wanted to come on here really quickly and show you guys the books that i did find for one penny this one here someone had already peeled the sticker off of but i indeed flipped it over to check that upc code on it and it does have the same code. As you see, all of these have like a sticker on top of the original barcode. See there, we can see where the original barcode was. And then these are just all like stickers on top of that. Every single one of them looks like that. Where Dollar General, I guess, got them at a discounted rate and sold them in their stores for a dollar. So anyways, just want to come on here really quickly show you guys these books that i found i did not find any of the penny hostess um um i linked i pinned a post to the top of my penny video with the upc codes on that you're going to look for the hostess chocolate twinkies and the hostess chocolate and peanut butter twinkies and if you find those they will also be ringing up a penny as of today tuesday august 28th so, hope you guys have a good time out hunting. Let me know down below what um, all items you may have found today. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Okay, and also, guys, just remember, don't go into your stores asking any of the Dollar Journal employees where any of the penny items are. Go in. You know what you're supposed to be looking for. You're supposed to be looking for books with $1, $2, or $3 on them, don't go in the store asking them where their books are because they're probably going to assume that you're looking for penny items. You just go into your stores, look for any books that you see in there, and search these UPC codes and match those codes up. Don't go into your stores asking where any of the penny items are. The Dollar General employees will not help you find those items. They were supposed to have been pulled from the shelf, and if the Dollar General employees fail to do their job and pull these items off of the shelf, off of the sales floor, it is a go for us to go in and hunt for these items. So remember, don't go and ask them anything about it. Don't go in making a mess in their stores if you do go in hunting. I know they probably have a lot of books in the little display boxes throughout your stores. Just gently pull them out, sift through, and look for those UPC codes that we need to look for. I will include the um, last four digits of the UPCs up here on the screen somewhere so you guys can see that. Again, or you can reference back to my penny video from last night. Thank you guys. And also really quick guys, I hate to be petty this morning, but I see that there are other YouTubers out here trying to down us YouTubers that are doing penny items, claiming that they are the only one that knew of the penny list and had the entire penny list. First of all, if you live in an area that does not get those Twinkie cakes, your stores are not going to get a list to pull those items because they don't sell those Twinkie cakes. Some stores carry them around me, some stores do not. So the store that I get my list from personally, they do not carry those, those um, Hostess cupcakes in the display boxes or the little Twinkies 
you know they're in a display box within the store the store that i get my list from personally i do not copy my list off of anybody from the internet i personally have the paper right here in hand where the list was printed off from dollar general's computer and given to me now i always just take a picture of the item description and the upc codes because that is all of the information that you guys need so i am not out here stealing information from anybody i personally was given this list from a dollar general employee and i'm taking this information and turning around and giving it to you guys we are not here to tear each other down we are here to build each other up i will not bash any youtuber on here that gives you any penny information even if they give you false information because they were falsely informed I'm not gonna come on here and bash anybody and say hey they don't know what they're talking about you need to subscribe to my channel because I know what I'm talking about I'm not gonna bash anybody on YouTube because that's not what we're here to do we're here to bash um, we're here to uplift and encourage each other to continue on with our channels put out the best content that you possibly can and I hope you guys understand that I am in competition with nobody. But anyways, just wanted to come on here really quickly and throw that out there because I see that there are the YouTubers out here bashing people this morning and I think it's rather unnecessary. But anyways, talk to you guys later.